first class product that basically has floor to ceiling walls at the side. Hello, <laughs> sorry. It's three o'clock in the morning, but that's okay because I'm super excited for the flight that I'm about to take. I'm going to be taking a ride with Emirates in their first class product on board a 777, but it's not just any first class of Emirates. It is their new private suite first class. It is the only first class product in the world that offers a fully enclosed private room, and I'm going to be trying it for a nine hour flight from here in Dubai over to Kuala Lumpur. So come with me, we'll go check it out and see what it's all about. As airline seats go, I've had worse, really. Just look at this. Absolutely phenomenal. It's literally a hotel room on a plane. It's like a private jet, even better than a private jet, you know, more like an Air Force One or something. It's just TV, minibar. It's just Absolutely incredible. <laughs> So Emirates were the first airline to introduce a first class product that has complete floor to ceiling walls around each suite. Um, there is still no other airline that does it in their first class product and just it's incredible. I can't shut the door yet because we're not taking off but it's fully enclosed, it's just like a hotel room. And isn't it amazing? Unbelievable. I love it. Tonight then took us east out of Dubai to cross India before dropping down towards Malaysia. Flight time tonight, a brisk 6 hours and 45 minutes, cruising at 39,000 feet. So then, where to start with this absolutely incredible first class suite on the Emirates 777? I guess we start with the door. Um, and if we pull that to, we can just lift that up full on minibar set up here, both sides are there, and down here, toiletry set, and a notepad and pen, nice little Emirates notepad and pen, stowage for your trolley case for your carry-on basically, that's where you put that, and then this here, I mean just look at the quality of this, it's just the finishings here are modelled after Mercedes cars um, and they've got exactly the same sort of fittings in them that you would find in a high-end Mercedes so I mean look at this <laughs> table blimey loads of controls along here we can do the windows or window blinds so if I press that you'll see the window blinds will go up oh, beautiful sunrise <laughs> lovely sunrise out there um, and they go back down again quite quickly if I can do it and then this actually becomes <laughs> just a tablet that you can sit on your knee and do different things with as well and then it goes back into its dock when you're done and these curtains obviously we've got oh, which will come and close completely which I'll do in a little while this really is like a hotel room isn't it you've got curtains and everything <laughs> Incredible. The seat is so, ooh, so comfortable. We've then got a wardrobe, an actual wardrobe, and 
that spins around. Look, so we've got um, safety card and things in here, headphones, duvet and everything, coat hanger up there. Do you look at the lighting on here? I don't know whether you can see the floor is kind of all, there's stars in the floor and up in the sky. But this here, this here doofer, lighting, we can say, right, we want to turn the lighting up and down, we can do that. But not only that, we can change the colour of them and get mood lighting around. So, I don't know, if we want to, have to get a bit of a red light district theme going on here. You can see all the lights have gone red. Look at that. And we can turn down the ceiling light. And then we've got red lights all around, or we could change it to sort of any colour we like, really. Incredible. And then we've got the temperature. And we can actually control the temperature of the suite. Again, how many other airliners give you that option? This is the most incredible seat. I can't even call it a seat. It's the most incredible suite that I've ever had on board a flight. Um, honest, honestly, there is nothing better than this. I think, aside from maybe the Etihad residence, you know, for standard first class flight prices, you don't get much better than this. You're probably not subscribed to me on YouTube, as only about half of you are, so I'd love it if you could please take a second to hit that subscribe button. I release videos like this every week and every subscriber helps me to keep the channel growing and keep this content coming. So aside from all the other wonderfulness in the first class suite, I've now got an amenity kit to go through as well. Links, shaving foam. Bulgari stuff. A razor. <laughs> Gym jams. I wonder if they'll fit. Slippers, eye mask. This would make a lovely laptop case, actually, this would. Hydroactive sleepwear. My set of jars, I'm gonna get changed, I think. We've only got sort of how long until we land into Kuala Lumpur, let's have a look. Six hours till we land, so I can get five hours of sleep, I think. Let's turn this mood lighting down. The ceiling light off. The wall light off. Floor light off. Mood lighting. Should I get on purple? Purple? No? Maybe? Green? What's green? Whoa, green. It's like being under the sea. Let's set it to purple. It's so cool. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> right, time for bed. I'll see you in the morning. Good night. While I sleep, a big thanks to Dash Lane who take care of all of your passwords while you sleep. <laughs> see what I did there? Dashlane makes it super easy to securely store all of your passwords, cards and important documents and access them on the go. It allows you to quickly generate a unique, highly secure password for each website you visit and auto fills them on your devices so you never have to remember a password again. It's far more secure than reusing that same password with different numbers at the end over and over again. It also makes it really easy to fill in your card details whenever you make an online purchase, which is really handy for me as I can just click and fill in my card details without having to go rooting through my wallet. Aside from the cards, it stores things like your passport, so wherever I am in the world, I can just open up the app and pull down my passport details. Great for when I'm trying to check in online or apply for e-visas when they need to know every last tiny detail of your life. To try the exclusive offer of getting Dashlane for free on your first device at dashlane.com slash noel, and then when you want to upgrade to premium, which I think you will, use my code noel to get 25% off. Good morning. Um, woken up now, we've got about an hour and a half left to run into KL. And we're over the Andaman Islands. And if you can see on the <laughs> screen there, we're flying over some little islands in the middle of the um, 
the sea at the minute, which is quite nice. By and large, slept really well. Uh, this bed is so, so comfy. And then to wake up and realise that you're still in this sort of private room, this private hotel room sort of thing on the plane, it just makes it incredible. Um, so I'm going to have some coffee. They've just brought me some coffee and juice around and I'm going to decide if I actually want any breakfast before we land or I might get something when we actually arrive into Kuala Lumpur. So I've put the bed into what Emirates call the zero G position. And it's kind of a semi-reclined position which they say has been developed by NASA to um, essentially replicate the effects of zero gravity and there's no um, pressure on any of your body as you are sitting on it. It's like the most optimum and comfortable position. So let's have a sit down and see what it's like. actually really nice. <laughs> in the centre, this is the unique thing about the Emirates 777 uh, with these new suites on here, the centre wind, the centre seats obviously have no windows, if you look around the other side it's just a block and if you look actually here, this is the back side of the other one, however look at this so you come into these suites and they've still got a set of windows They are um, video screens basically, but they are ultra high definition uh, video screens showing you a view outside of the aircraft. So even if you're in the center of the plane with no window around you, you've still got a window view. And the coolest thing is, look at this, it's got the same controls down here as I have in my seat. exactly the same. <laughs> How cool is that? That's incredible, isn't it? You probably can't see on here as well, but the actual quality of these um, video screens, I was thinking that it would be kind of not very realistic and you might actually sort of clearly be able to see that you're uh, looking at a video screen, but actually it's just incredible. It's an incredible view and it's so high definition that you really can't tell unless you're looking really closely. You can't really tell that you're not looking out of a real window. Brilliant, isn't it? enjoying this video don't forget to check out my video in Emirates first class on the A380 next the links on the screen right now really can represent excellent value for money in first class, especially if you're able to get a ride in there or some new first class suites. Oh, bye bye wonderful suite, I don't want to leave you. <laughs> I don't think my hotel's going to be as nice as this. Absolutely incredible. I don't want to leave. I'm just stay on board and we'll go back. <laughs> <laughs> 
I need to go back that way, do I? This okay. one they'll open a bit later. Ah, okay. Yeah. Well, lovely you to travel fly. Safe, sir. Thank you God very much. Well, lovely to travel with you. Thank you. Oh, you're more than welcome. Thank you for the service. It was incredible. This is a new business class, okay. Because the old one is just um, 222, two, two, is it? Tell them the old one, or is it 232? Two, three, two? Three two, two. Yeah, okay. The older seats. Oh, yeah. And this one as well, they imagine like a car. Uh, yes, yes. You know, like even like here. Yeah, with the um, support and everything, yeah. It's still really nice, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. All right. well, <laughs> well, lovely to see you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thanks very much. Bye bye. Thank you. Bye bye. bye, -bye. Oh, it's great to be back here in Malaysia even if I'm not actually officially in Malaysia I'm in the transit hotel here at KL International Airport um, which is pretty decent and it's got some good views out over the um, aircraft outside as well look at that Etihad Dreamliner sitting there on the um, ramp. For me personally, that is the best flight I've ever had and it is the best seat I've ever had on a commercial flight. I don't think there's anything out there apart from maybe, as I mentioned earlier, the um, residence on Etihad that comes close to giving an experience like that um, on board a commercial aircraft in first class. Let me know what you think to Emirates' new first class suites down in the comments below. In the meantime, as always, thank you so much for watching. Take Take care, and I'll see you next time. You know what, actually, I think the plane was better. See if they let me back on.